I'm Paul King. I am quite literally doing an unboxing of an ARC um, home management system. So all you're going to see here is me opening this and seeing what's in it. Our home management system is a Wi-Fi router, a media server, 4K media server, a Z-Wave gateway, a couple other things. You also might end up seeing me cut myself on air. All right. So, quite simply, what's in the box? Um, packing foams. Home management system. And the box. And some more packing. All right. What do they send here? talking points connect Wi-Fi Bluetooth and Z-Wave compatible smart home devices to control your lights thermostat home security and more from one easy home management system Pair your devices to schedule automated smart scenes track energy consumption with Z-Wave powered metered devices use the arc smart hub to tap in and find out how much energy your devices are using and discover ways to save Search by cast. No, hold on. Search by cast, genre, year, rating, and more for blockbuster movie titles and critically acclaimed TV shows. Enjoy live TV from local and international channels. I'm kind of confused on that one. I hadn't heard that one. Did I put that up? No, that's right. Hold on. So, on this side of the box, this is up. And that is up. Here's the back of the box. Oh, okay. Never mind. Never mind. Goes like that. Yeah, okay. Let's see what else the talking points are. Um, blah, 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 blah. between low normal and through the wall mode to extend or shorten your network range and blacklist devices connect to the networks download games and apps from the Google Play Store uh, oh I guess it needs to be an Android powered thing US based in-house customer service and technical support all right uh, da -da -da. that and of course someone's texting me like nonstop z-wave device Oh my god. Alright, so uh yeah. Just gonna turn off the phone. I'll just put it do not disturb. Which I should have done before. But I've never done a live broadcast and this will probably be my last. What? Just do not disturb. Oh, you know what? I'm just gonna turn it off. Alright, so Let's see what we got in here. Ooh, cellophane. This was the Gobi from yesterday. Anybody was looking or reading pocketables? All right. Uh, 
Amazing. Here we have the arc. On the back, AC. I don't know what this is. Oh, it might help if I held this up. Very DC. Hard drive HDD. You know, hard drive thing? Uh, two USB 2 ports. I had a lot of going back and forth with them on why were they using USB 2. One HDMI, uh, two LAN ports, and one WAN port, and an AV plug. I think that this is optical, but I don't know. Let's see what else is in the box. Here's something. Quick start, good. We got a double sided remote. One side is just a keypad, and the other side is your standard remote. Uh, one HDMI. Power adapter. Actually, that is a 0.5 amp, 240 volt, uh, 12 volt, 1.5 amp. And very nifty looking, very heavily shielded network cable. Boom. Rando thing. Um, let me see. Quick start. All right. So we got the arc, the remote, the ethernet cable, the power cord, and the HD cable. Should be HDMI cable. All right. So I don't know what, let's see. So we have to log in a little Android device. Um, let's see. So let's give the specs here while I'm doing this. Let's say quad core, two gigahertz. Uh, Processor doesn't say what the uh, type is. Graphics are Pentacore ARM Mali 453D, 2 gigabytes of DDR3 RAM, 16 gigabyte eMMC flash. Um, the router is an MT7628 plus MT7612 1200 megabits. Has 256 megabytes of flash. Its gateway is Z-Wave and Wi-Fi. The Ethernet is 10 megabits and 100 megabits, full duplex port. This is the other thing. I've sort of had it uh, back and forth. Well, not had it. I've, I've talked with them repeatedly back and forth about the 100 megabit thing just seems like total underkill. Um, then again... You don't really need over 100 megabits to stream 4K video in most cases. Um, if you're trying to stream some, oh, I should probably point this up at me. Uh, if you're trying to stream UHD, maybe we'd have a problem. Wi-Fi is IEEE 802.11bgnac. It's got Bluetooth, Android 7.2 built on. 
and we'll do 4K at 60 FPS, two USB 2 ports, a micro SD slot. Do they have a micro SD slot? Oh, yeah, I did. I, uh, I completely skipped over that. Micro SD slot, a WPS button. Guessing. Yeah, that's a power button. Maybe a WPS button. I don't know. I don't know where this WPS. Maybe it's. Did you do WPS from here? Oh well, we'll say it has it. I don't know. Um, blah, 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 blah. HD has an AV port, SPDIF. And it looks like, what is that, micro SPDIF? It is 2.05 pounds and 9.5 inches by 5.75 inches. So that's, that's it. That's the arc. We'll be covering that later on, on Pocketables, probably next week and working on trying to create scenes, integrating it with a home security system. Um, and maybe Google Home if I can figure out how to do that. Ah, well, no one's watching. Anyway, um, hope you enjoyed.